Hello my friends and welcome to an entirely new project. One which is a sequel to a game I've played in the past on my Xbox 360. And this is called Blue Dragon Awakened Shadow. This is the sequel to the original which came out on Xbox 360, and a, a goddamn shame it never had some kind of port, preferably Steam, if not just limited to Steam, or probably a PS4 release or any other kind. Maybe like, um, I don't know, Switch. <clears throat> now, this has. Nintendo Wi-Fi stuff, but um, since this emulator, there's no point in me doing that. So I have everything set up to where it's controller friendly, so let's get into this, shall we? Shadow. A new power that creates soul light. Two years have passed since Shu and his allies, armed with the power of shadows, defeated Ninin, Scion of the Ancients. As time went on, more and more people came to wield shadows until this power became a part of their lives. <clears throat> A great shadow bearing the power to change the entire world. It's about to awaken silently. Of course, the artwork you may have noticed is Akira Toriyama's work. Excuse me. I'm a little more than shocked that this never made into Jump Force. I mean, there was a short-lived anime based off this game. This custom, like say Dragon Ball, you can choose your character between a boy or a girl. We're going for a boy, and of course. Let's see, we're going for... We're 
We're going for a face that strikes fear in the heart, so. The Tomino verse. No. No. The Toriyama verse. <laughs> Greetings, greetings, and greetings. Yeah, that's a face, all right. Well. It's only fair we gave him, since we already have a shoe, well, we're going to give this boy the best name we can possibly give him. Because it's only fair we call him. got a shoe, there needs to be a way. If you don't see the joke, I feel sorry for you. That's the first thing that comes to mind. I'm bursting with power. I wonder what's become of the outside world. No sense in wondering about it. It must have become a future beyond our wildest dreams. If you're going to brawl, I guess I'll treat myself to a tour of the future. tone of yours hasn't changed since ancient times. Meganda in June. If this doesn't predate Dragon Ball Super, I don't know what does. Ancient times, you're wrong. Our time is frozen in the past. We awoke in this world after transcending time. As for it, it must have grown while we were asleep for so long. Also as unbeaten as ever. Oh, never mind. 
let's go search for it. So basically... We use the stylus to reach our target destination. And... If we need to, we can use a camera by using by using the shoulder buttons. So we're in control of these two. So if the stylus need to be used, it will be used. And these two are both level 30. So you can either use the stylus to touch the enemy you want to attack, or pressing the A button to attack. So you can touch your character for protection, or press B to defend yourself. This is more action RPG based than, say, the original was. Which is a nice change of pace because Blue Dragon was indeed a turn base. Launch a shadow attack like I did that already. It's basically you charge it. That's how you basically change it up. Know your limitations. <laughs> So in short, to use your skills, charge with A and use the D-pad to select which attack you want to use. Know your limitations. Which isn't a bad thing, you know, in the grand scheme of things. Disable the lock by pressing a switch. Find the corresponding switch and press it. There are times you'll need items for unlocking. Set the car key to enter the group. Which they apparently had on their person the entire time. Question about it is that it is inside.
I'm in Crystallis. should find a way out of here. So, this just tells you the mini-map. Blue triangle marks and the blue triangle marks indicates the direction you're facing, interests and maps, you know that sort of thing. So as you can tell, he also has a heal spell. So he has Grand Sword, Flare, and Heal. Are you okay? Buster Wolf? locked tightly. Save queue. If you see the game over dialogue, you'll have to start from your last save point. So we gotta drop a save. Like so. Save one, save often. So let's operate the elevator like so, taking us up. Is this? A town? Uh, as you can tell, our stats are as follows. Our attack and defense are at 12, magical power at 9, and defense are at 7. This has such a Dragon Quest theme vibe to it. So this is Neo Gibro Castle Town, the residential area. Kluk, if you don't know, is the girl from the opening. She wields the Phoenix um, Shadow. And as you can tell, this is ne Neil G. Castle Castletown. Seems pretty noisy right here. Something happened? What's going on? I've lost my shadow power! 
Look at me. My shadow won't emerge either. Just when I finally have learned how to use it. What was that like just now? Maybe that's why we distinguish our shadows. No, it looked to me like that light sucked our shadows away. Shadow? Shadow. I wonder what this means. Looks like I can use my shadow. Where am I? Hey, you have a shadow. Huh? Oh, um, I hear you lost your shadows. Did something happen? <laughs> It was just another day in Neo Jeep. And all of a sudden this happened. just happened. It's not something you can explain. The light just sucked away our shadows. Right? Just when I finally learned how to use that shadow too, but you seem to be the only one who didn't lose that shadow. Pretty mysterious. Yes, well... Well, better watch your back. Never know when that light might come back. Right. What? What? Hey, how come you still have your shadow? Hey, I didn't know this was voice acting. Well, I, you see... Oh man, why'd they have to take it? Oh well. I'll just get it back like I did that other time. What other time? Cluke! Zero! Come here! There's someone with a shadow! Zero's the guy with the, um, tar shadow. Oh, you're right! It's true, but why? Hey, why do you still have your shadow? Where were you when that weird light flashed just now? You shouldn't ask so many questions on the first meeting. You'll startle them. Sorry, I'm sure you have no idea what's going on. I know that the shadows are gone because I just heard it out from someone else. Right, it, it was a very strange thing. Why do you still have yours when we lost all of ours? I don't know. When you got here, see? You're a traveler, but you don't have any luggage on you. No. Wouldn't a traveler leave their luggage at their lodging so they can go sightseeing? I don't find it strange at all. Um, where am I now? This is Neo Gibral Castle Town. And you can call me Shu. Whoa. Wait. I'm Cluke. And Dagger. I mean... <laughs> I'm Jiro. Nice to meet you. Where were your voice actors just now? What's your name? I'm Wei. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you! But they didn't take your shadow. You must have an amazing soul light. Soul light? Huh? You've never heard of soul light? No? 
So light is the power of emotion. We all have it. Those feelings when you cry, you laugh, get angry, and that's what generates a shadow. So light generates shadows. Well, that's right! Hey, never mind that! Where'd you come from, Wei? You keep saying, I don't know. You're pretty funny. Oh, shoot, that's rude. Well, we really shouldn't cry too much. We'll be off then. See you later, everybody. Hi! Come on, shoot. Let's go. Yeah, but why is this kid the only one with a shadow? That's weird. Never mind, just come with me. That's what she says. The real question is what's weird about it? You're the only one that has a power in which everybody's. Everybody else got their powers taken away. But yours is still there. Explain how weird is that, huh? There's no point in going back. Let's move forward for now. There's a piece of paper on the door. Barbara Giroux. Opening soon. Ah! Hmm? Was that a scream? Over there. It came from over there! That monster. Oh, shoot! Where's this monster? Oh. Take you out! Oh, boy, my shadow's got her. Get out of here! Oh. Watch out! Are you okay? Yes, yes, thanks so much for saving me. Wow, that was awesome. Not really. You know what? I need to know more about you. Eh? Okay, I'm gonna show you around. Come on! 
We got everything in Neo Gibraltar. Castle, hospital, even a lab. So many places, I don't know where to start. Hey, I know. The first stop should be the shop. I'm good friends with the storekeeper. Shop's at the bottom of the stairs there. Let's go. That's the old guy's shop. Hi! Hey, old man! Are you making a profit? <laughs> hey, is that you, Shoe? Yeah, I'm in change. Never seen that kid before. Who brand the old? Yeah, name's Wait. Nice to meet you. Shop has everything from medicine to weapons. Wow. If you're gonna buy some, you should come here. He knows more about products than anyone in Neil Gibral. <laughs> Thanks for the endorsement. Well, she just told you I, I do have everything in stock. If going on adventure, you can stock up on supplies here. Okay, gotcha. Okay, where should we go next? I know. We have to go to the symbol of our town. Neil Gibral Castle. Neil Gibral Castle? Right! It's really a huge castle. And I know a lot of people there. Oh? It's all north side of town. Let's go! So I'll see you around, okay? I'll drop by soon. <laughs> right, see you. So at least it tells you where everything is. So the cube lab is to the east of us. Yasato's house is to the west of us. Shoo! Kanook! This kid's shadow's amazing! Huh? Really? Oh, I don't know about that. There you go again. Yeah, but I saw it myself. That monster was toast. With one blow from a shadow. Wow. By the way, where's Jiro? In the Algebra Castle. Something strange up here. I hear. And now that we've lost our shadows, they want him to investigate. What a strange thing. I don't know. Oh, come on. Now you don't know either? Hey, I should take you to meet King Gibral. Hmm? King? King? Y you mean like a real king? That's right. I mean, you're the only one with a shadow now. Come on. Let's head to the castle. I really shouldn't poke at that thing on my arm. Wait up! I'm coming with you! Uh -huh. That makes me kind of nervous. Hi! Master Shu, Miss Cook, good job. Oh! Uh. Huh? What's going on? That's the one. That's the one who came out of that weird thing I saw with my own eyes. What are you talking about? You see, you see, this person tells us that he saw something resembling an unidentified elevator appear in the castle town. So by weird thing, he meant elevator. Swooshed out of nowhere and opened with a bang. That kid came out of it. I almost had a heart attack. Is that true? Uh, yeah. I came out of an elevator and... 
We'd like to talk to you. Huh? <laughs> We're taking you to see the king. Hold up. This kid's no villain. The kid is a shadow. It just defeat a monster. Please save your explanations for the king. We're merely carrying out orders. As I do. Now then, please excuse us. Hey, wait up! More stubborn than I thought. So here we are inside the castle. Your Majesty, we brought in the one who arrived in the mysterious elevator. I commend you for your duty. You may go back to your post now. Yes, sir. Hey, that's the one who... See, though, so you know this person. Yes. We just met in town. We talked. King Gibral! Shoo! What's the matter with you two? Nothing's the matter with me! King Gibral, what are you going to do? Hang on, I don't know what you're talking about. A monster appeared just now. The, and this kid got rid of it with a shadow. They're not a bad guy! <laughs> Is it true you can wield the shadow? Yes. Is it true that you came out of that elevator? By the way, not the same King Gibral as in the first game. But Zola is the same. Where am I being? It's been a long time since I actually played Blue Dragon, so it might have been his son. Yes. The elevator. Where does it be? The thing is, I have no idea myself. I think I must have been asleep till a little while ago. I woke up and started wandering around, and there was the elevator, and I got on it, and it took me to this town. Sleep? Where were you sleeping? I don't know, but since I came up here in that elevator, I must have been underground. It might be a good idea to go down in that elevator after all. It might have some connection with the ancient culture. It's not as if there's no precedent. By the way, Shu, you're quite sure that this person can use a shadow? Yeah, I'm sure! I saw it with my own eyes! Don't you think there's a chance it wasn't lost because they were underground? That's what I was thinking too, after all. It was before they showed up at that we lost our shadows. King Gibral, we'll go down there now. If we could take them with us, they might remember something. Or find out something, right? I do. Right, uh, maybe I will. Uh, Jiro, what do you think? I agree with you. But we can't let Shu go by himself. Shall I go too? What's up with that? I mean, I have a shadow, but I can handle it. Then I'll go too. No, wait. Jiro, did I not entrust you with a certain task cutter? Let us leave the underground to shoot, and in the meantime, you shall carry on here. Huh? What's going on? It's something we excavated recently. 
Advanced Zero Two Investigate. Well, well, why don't you stay here and do your investigating? Then? You can leave the underpass to us. How about you? Just has a case of you know what? He's addicted to adventure. I mean, well, I, I, I guess that's true. <laughs> True, I am sure you are ill at ease without the use of your shadow. I shall send Zola with you. Agree, Zola? Yes, sir. Zola's got awesome power. We can count on her. Don't worry. We'll get to the bottom of who you are. Yeah, right. Chu, Zola, thanks for helping me out. Uh, yes? I have arranged for a room in the castle to be prepared for you. Feel free to use it as a resting place when you are wary. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. One more thing. This view. Some equipment and 200 gold. I am counting on you to reap results. Yes, sir. You can leave it to us. Alright, let's head over to the spot where the elevator appeared. The door to the other world! So another tutorial to tell you how to equip yourself with weapons, armors, and accessories. <sighs> Short terms, you press L and R to change equipment types. Attach the character's face, or press the X button. Change how their equipment, your, you change how you're equipped. You can turn the equipment guy on or off, or reorder your weapon by number or level. So, if I so wanted to, I can use my um, mouse or, as I'm doing this, with controller. Let me show you to your room. A room has been prepared for you on the first floor, in the vast hall in, in the vast, in the west hallway in the castle. You should prepare for your journey in the, your room before you leave. Which does make sense because I feel the need to drop the save. Oh my way. I've been waiting for you. Now then, please. That's your bed. You can recover your health and death. When you're tired, don't push yourself. Get some rest. And this is your cabinet. You can keep your items, the ones you can't carry. Here as well as change clothes. 
please use this as you would your own. I'll make sure your bed's fluffy and your room is squeaky clean, so please come back in time. Good night, then. drop a save like so because that was the prologue and this is going to be our main save. So, in the next part, we shall take things from here and most likely start up with a beatdown. So stay tuned. More of Blue Dragon Awakened Shadow right after this. Thanks so much for watching.